Hello, what is up everyone? Norman from Future Studio University here and welcome to another video in our Android Studio series. Now I have recorded 15 videos on my favorite Android Studio shortcuts, but learning them one by one might not be ideal or especially efficient. Better would be if you know about it whenever you use something that could have been a shortcut. And in this video, I'm going to show you a plugin for that, which automatically notifies you when you do something that could have been an efficient shortcut. So let's get into it. All right, so this series is gonna kick off a few Android Studio plugins and you can always install them over via the preferences. So when you open the preferences, you can go to plugins and here you'll find a list of uh, possible plugins which have been installed by default. And you can also look for different ones in browser repositories. And the one I'm going to show you in this video is Key Promoter. There are two versions of it. Um, there's the old version and the X version, which is a little bit newer. Um, so I recommend installing the Key Promoter X version. Um, as you see, um, I already have it installed um, with plugins. Uh, you don't have installed, you have the button. Here you don't have a button, so I already have it installed. So what's the plugin? Well, what the plugin does is whenever you do an action, which could have been a shortcut, it will give you a little pop-up. So for example, if I'm going to refactor this and use rename, which you even can see that there's a shortcut right here, it will do the action, but down here you will see, hey, you could have done this with Shift F6. And if you click on the Shift F6, it takes you to the key map, so you can actually remap the shortcut. So that's usually pretty helpful if you have an action you use a lot um, but you don't like the shortcut at all and you're like hey this gets this papa comes again and again um, this is a fast way to change the shortcut to something you like um, and you can remember what i also like about um, key promoter x is that you actually get a statistics or statistics so if you open this tab up here you will see how often i did some actions um, and not using the shortcuts. For example, I love using the, um, the run command up here via the button instead of the shortcut. And this is an easy way of learning um, continuously about shortcuts and improving and um, making use of the keyboard instead of always using the, the slower mouse. Anyway, that's it for this video. So let me know what your favorite plugins are and subscribe if you want to see the next videos about my other favorite plugins. Enjoy coding and make it rock.